Back with some more judgment. Uh, oh shit, what am I supposed to do? I think I already did it. Yeah, I did. Alright. I gotta do this main story. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm my stomach hurt. It's bro, y'all think I I don't be grinding, bro? Like look at this. Look at this. But, oh fuck. I don't know if y'all can see that. Can y'all see that? Y'all see that time? I gotta grind. My stomach hurt, but I'm gone, bro. I'm <laughs> all right, but I'm gonna still try to. I just don't want to wake up my roommate. I'd be feeling bad sometimes because I know we get loud. I needed a warm up. I just can't get hyped, you know what I'm saying? I, I gotta relax. On, okay, so how do I? Okay. Yeah, how do I? Okay. Okay. Oh shit. Okay. Damn! Yo, that was crazy! See, I gotta relax, I gotta relax, I gotta keep it down, I gotta keep it down. That shit was insane, though. They was really trying to hide it. Oh, Yagami-san, I have another question. You're probably wondering what kind of English I've been studying in the first place. Mm -hmm. Nah, you're fine. Hit me with the question. Okay, there was this customer who ordered something for takeout. What's that supposed to mean? Take you, your life. <laughs> what the? I kind of wanna. Let me stop. It's another way of saying take it to go. Oh, so that's why they were looking at me all weird. I brought their order out as usual without packing anything up. Now I felt kind of bad. What now? You know something new. I'm sure you won't make the same mistake twice. He he, you got such a good perspective on things. Yo, doing these voices actually hurt myself in there. I think it's talking, period. That's fucked up. I might not be doing voices this uh, session. Don't walk into walls, bro. Let me just go towards this mission. Oh, wait, wait. Dumbass map. Oh, friendship. Friendship. Man in the suit. You're yeah, gonna be son, yes? I just want to say thank you for talking to the president whenever he's here. Oh yeah, that mm. dude. I love this. Um, you were... What's a Mura song? That's right, I'm, I'm so good, bro. I, just, I was like, he look like a Motomura, bro. He don't look like a Machi, whatever the other fucking shit was. A president you know, says, secretary. We're always rushing in here to find the president even though you're nearly out of breath. Yes, the president is a very diligent man. Who often visits the stores to check up on them. Is that so? What a hard working guy. Mm -hmm. Wait. You're by yourself today, Matamura san. Yes, I am. The president told me I should watch and observe as well. He said I might learn something. That's why I've been standing here like this all day long. <laughs> That's what that. Hmm. I wonder why he'd tell you something like that. Beats me. 
All I know is I don't have time to be loafing around here like this. What do you mean? If I'm not around, then who's going to manage the president's busy schedule? Only I have to know how to make all that work. Just like planning the president's every move is more complex than it's better than it seems. Yeah, thanks to me, the company's still running in the first place. <sighs> he said, you talking shit? Matamorkon, I'm sorry, but you're mistaken. <laughs> oh, he said, you talking that shit. That voice. I gotta do his voice. Whoa, since when did you get here? Matamorkon, haven't you heard this saying? <laughs> To whom you owe your gratitude can be cause for peace or strife. <laughs> Do you understand the meaning behind this, Motomorukun? To whom you owe. Who even says whom these days? <laughs> Look at his eye. You see, Motomorukun, I appreciate your hard work every day. You always go above and beyond. Arigato. Thank you for that. N no, it's my pleasure. But you shouldn't only credit yourself either. Gratitude is best when shared with others. Not only kept for yourself. You mustn't forget about everyone else who makes this business possible. I want you to realize this by looking at the way our staff members work. You're right. Lately, I just felt so busy that all I could focus on was myself. Sorry for what I said. <laughs> oh, there's no need to apologize. I'm just glad you understand where I'm coming from. Yes, from here on out, I'll be turning over a new leaf. Indeed you will, or I'll beat your ass, nigga. <laughs> That's why I'm having you relocate to this branch for a month effective today. Okay, I'll... Wait, what? <laughs> Remember how inspired you were today? That passion will help you survive the monotonous hell that is customer service. Besides, working like this builds character. Wouldn't you agree? <sighs> More like build stress. <laughs> I learned a lot from you, President Ichinose. Ichinose? Ichinose? Gratitude is best shared with others. Those are wise words. <laughs> Those are wise words. Uh, it's a little more common sense. Oh, it's a little more than common sense. Now that Moritomorikun has learned this for himself, I'm sure we'll refine his character a bit. Hmm. I think so too. This may sound odd, but I sometimes see myself as a parent rather than a president. Not only do I want my employees to be happy with what they do, but I also want to see them mature and grow as people. Though I'm sure not all of them feel the same way. <laughs> well, I'd say it's fine either way. Arigato. Thanks, Yagami-san. Oh. I really hope my roommate can't hear me. Oh, that's not good. Hmm? What happened? I forgot. I have an important meeting today. That's hilarious. What the Murakun usually keeps track of my schedule, but maybe he <laughs> really is driving force of the company. <laughs> well, see you later, Yagami-san. Oh, and please come back and enjoy our st steaks again. Sure thing. Oh, sure thing. Take care. <laughs> there he goes. He really had a strong presence about him. Hope he gets to his meeting on time. Now I better be careful where I place my gladness. Terrible. Well, I'm thankful for these stakes for one. Let me just go ahead and finish over here. 
Oh my fucking skeleton. Oh, what the fuck? Let's go. Damn! Okay, okay. Shit. Get off me. Yep. Take your kneecaps. Move. Bomb. What is that move called? I swear I've seen that before. It's probably some crazy Brazilian Jiu Jitsu type move. Let me get to this mission. I hope y'all can hear me. I was like, gag me, I know you. Come on. This is where the client told me to meet him. Oh shit, what the fuck? Am I about to get jumped by Power Rangers? Detective Yagami. Are you my client? Ah. Yeah. You can call me Pro. I don't trust these niggas at all. Hmm? That mask. Are you in that group of thieves everyone's been whispering about lately? Why, you wouldn't snitch if I was, would you? If I was, would you? We may be thieves, but we don't steal from the righteous. Just the bad guys. You know, like Robin Hood. And because they're bad, it's not a crime. That's for a judge to decide, not me. <laughs> really. You're more of a goody two shoes than I thought. Barkeep at Tinder told me this was a request from one of his regulars. But he knew I turned down a request from the thief, so he lied to me. Damn, that's cool. Damn, that's crazy. Here's the thing I protect my client's privacy, so you can rest easy about that. But if you're trying to get me to help you steal something, I'm not accepting your case. Okay, that suits me fine. Because all I want you to do is find someone. Hmm? Find someone? He goes by Jester. I don't know his real name. So he's... Oh. Yes, he's one of ours. But I haven't been able to reach him for a while. I think it's safe to say he's missing in action. You know... What... Oh, sorry. You know what he looks like? As his name suggests, he wears a Jester's mask. Oh, really? No chance. I know exactly who that is. One of our guys screwed the pooch, and we ended up needing to run from the cops. We only managed to get away because Jester distracted them. Hmm, sounds like a hell of a friend. That's when we lost touch with him, though. But he's way too good to get captured. And that's what makes his silence all the more perplexing. Sounds like you have a lot of faith in him. He's our ace in the hole. He's smart, professional, and really good. So if he's in trouble, we need to be there for him this time. We need to be there for him this time. Stick together. I see. I pay you 50 grand. And don't worry, it's clean money. Hmm. I was curious about that guy myself. If I take this job, maybe we'll cross paths again. Yeah. Alright. Accept the case. <laughs> then it's a done deal. We'll be expecting the results. Expecting results. Wait, how should I get in touch with you if I find anything? Come back here when you find something out. We always have someone watching this spot. We'll know when you come, yagami san I see. So long then. There they go, running off again. Like a bunch of fucking shinobi or something. Wait, you want something like, why do you stick around like that? I'm helping a group of notorious thieves find their buddy. What is life if not an adventure? Where do I even begin? I guess it wouldn't hurt to check out the spot where I saw him last. If I recall, that was the building behind T Tenkaichi Street. Tenkaichi Street? Let's move. Damn, that was graceful. I keep doing that. I think I'm playing Ghost. 
Sorry, I, that's hilarious. I got distracted by a chicken rest straight to a wall. That's on some movie shit. Uh... Oh, damn, dude. Excuse me. Oh, come on. Let me fucking... God! What the fuck? Oh, okay. <laughs> what a waste. It's always the fat guys that get it the worst, though. There's something you got against them? Yeah, give me talk to me. A side case? I mean, real quick. Uh oh. They here? Bro, I thought that dude was real. What the fuck? Oh, wait. God, I hate this fucking mini map. Yeah, it's over there, so. Is there another way? There has to be. Do you even have a green? Whatever, bro. They have a fucking goddamn green, goddamn bullshit. Is that my girl Saka or Sana? Oh, yeah, give me Sana. Hey there. How do you go with the agency? They're so quiet. Is something wrong? Oh, sorry about that. No, it's nothing. I must look pretty down, huh? Mm -hmm. Hmm? Ah, Sana san. I knew I'd find you sooner or later. What's up with this music? I heard you do a little performance here at night. I must say, you do you don't disappoint. But why waste your talent on all these thankless small time shows when you could step into the spotlight right now? Hmm. I wanna say they're thankless? Come on, look around you. You could be doing this in front of millions of people. All you have to do is sign with me. <laughs> hey, cheer up. This is a once in a lifetime opportunity. Besides, you won't get any fans with that gloomy face. Is this guy the producer she was talking about? Mm -hmm. And who might you be? Who are you, bro? Oh, I'm just an acquaintance. Hmm, an acquaintance, you say. You sure don't look like any ordinary guy to me. What line of work are you? This in? is Yagami. I'm a detective. The name's Yagami. Well, aren't you fancy? Here, why don't you take my card? Sato's business card. I may need to ask you for your expertise sometime. <laughs> then I'll be waiting for your call. Alright, Sana chan. My offer's still on the table, so think about it. Why did that music play when he walked in? Why he have his own theme music like that? Like I can't trust a guy who has his own theme music like that. Is that the producer you mentioned yeah. last time? Yeah. She said, yeah. His name is Saito-san. She's really not her usual self today. Hey, did something happen with him? Is he bothering you? I, I don't even know how to say it. He asked me to do a certain job as a condition for my professional debut. And what kind of job would that be? He wants me to entertain the CEO of a company his agency works with. Entertain? Like have dinner with them? If it was only that, then it wouldn't be too bad. But he told me to prepare for what happens after dinner. Bro, what are you talking huh? about, bro? Meaning he wants you to sleep with him. I'm not sure. He didn't give me a clear answer when I asked him. Hey, he just walked out. I could catch up to him and, um... 
make sure he never walks again. I could just be imagining things. Either way, it doesn't sound like something you can usually agree to. You can casually agree to. Right? Now, yagami san you did say you were a detective, didn't you? Mm -hmm. That I did. So, I've, I, I'm just going to speak a little bit. So, I've actually heard some bad rumors about this producer from my friend who's also trying to be a singer. Ah, she said that girls who get involved with the guy end up experiencing horrible things. That's a rumor you should... You probably shouldn't ignore, especially in your position. I thought as much. If the rumors turn out to be true, it seems he wants this girl for more than just our voice. That's why I was wondering. Um, you want me to? Yeah, get in his shit, bro. Whether you can trust him or not. That's right. I see. Will you do it, y'all? Give me some. Yes, we. Oh, I'll pay you how much. Help her out. Help the poor girl. The way they phrase that, or is like refuse her. Help the poor girl out. Like, bro, I've never been one to turn down an official case, so consider me at your Thank service. Thank you so much. I truly appreciate it. But I gotta warn you, I'm not cheap. Can someone who barely made it to the big city even afford something like this? Well, I. Yeah. Pay me when you're successful. Huh? Ooh. What? You don't have to pay me now. But when you make it big, I'm gonna charge you double. So pay me when you're successful. Ooh. I, I'm not sure if you're kind or just greedy. Well, I'm both. <laughs> Where's my money? Like, I'm running a business too. Thank you so much. Did not take you up on your offer. Thanks so much, Yagi son. I look forward to seeing you, Sean. Producer, the producer's name is Saito. He gave me his card. I know. He's usually scouting talent around Theater Square. Careful though. Now that he knows who you are, he might be out on guard. Who? <gasps> Yeah, I think it's up there. Oh, what a piece of shit. Mm. Tato's supposed to be hanging around Theater Square. Better head over there. Which is closer, though? do this fucking mission <laughs> I don't know this mission might be heat I might not want to do it yet if I'm gonna be sick as shit yeah, let's go then oh my god chill yo if I die here Give me this. Man, die then. God damn. And stay down. Now she let me eat some food. Like, I'm about to die. How do I get in there though? Oh my god, this fucking. This confusing ass area again. I jumped down, right? Now I go in here. Welcome, sir. Give me another cake. Give me two. Good stuff. Back to it. Thank you for visiting us today. Ah, uh, Sakuma-san. Hello there. Hello and welcome. Can I ask for your thoughts on today's cake yep. as well? Good thing. It might just be me, but I think the cheesecake's a little lacking in the sour department. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's not sour enough? Well, if I were a customer who wants something sweet, I'd probably pick something else. Almost anything can be sweet. 
but the thing that makes cheesecake a cheesecake is that unmistakable tang tanginess that lingers on the tongue. That's true. So I think you should keep sourness in mind when making your next batch. Oh, that was actually yep, yeah, yeah. Is this cake another original of yours, Sukumasa? It sure is. How do you like it? Mm. Okay, so the other one I had. It's pretty good, but it almost felt like it was missing something. It kinda just tasted like a normal cake, you know? It needs that special something to make it really stand out. That didn't tell her shit, bro. <laughs> Let me just put my personal uh, okay. Okay. All the same stuff. I'll come by later when I'm about to die. What's up? Damn, I'm kind of cool. Whoa, whoa. Bitch ass. Well, what are my, my moves even like with this stance? I don't got shit with this stance. Oh, right, as you kick off the wall. I mean, that's cool, but. How do you know all that, though? Yeah, wash it. Tiger only? I don't have any, like, swan only? Damn. Get up, bro, so I can do this move on you. What the fuck? I'm a beast. I'm a beast. Let me talk to you, player. Oh, there we go. <laughs> hey there, interested in becoming Japan's next top talent? Sorry, but no thanks. I'm in a hurry right now. She must talk. Oh, basic bitch. Yes, this is Saito. Uh huh. Yeah, about Sana Chan. That's Saito, alright. Now, what's he talking about, Sana Chan? Yep. Mm -hmm. Greg, I talked with her not too long ago. You know the deal. Okay. Absolutely. We'll do. I'll head over right now. Over there right now. Good. Lead the way, you jackass. There you go. Get on him. Let me hold, let me get my uh I got it for sure. But I'm trying to change my fit. I can't change my fit, that's fucked up. Oh, I didn't even notice, hold on. Oh, I can use R2 to sprint too. I didn't even notice I could fix my camera. The fuck is he doing? Bro, what is wrong with this dude?
from there. Oh my god, I really gotta... Alright. I didn't want him to be like waiting up at the top of the stairs for me and shit. Who the hell? It's like they're getting down to business. I need to get close enough to hear them both without getting caught. Put on your disguise, bro. It fits, bro. It fits. Alright, now nah, he's dropped without being caught. So how about her? She is she? Oh. Fuck yeah she is. How's the gal? Only 19, so she's right up your alley. Her name's Sana, Mahama. Says she wants to be a singer songwriter. <laughs> I ain't that adorable. I know, right? She seems really pure. But a lot of dudes will get off to that. <laughs> I can already see the captions. Innocent man, I really wanna do these voices, but I'm like fuck. Innocent babe bears it all on camera. Watch what she'll do for stardom. Sweet Sana Chai from the suburbs wants to be a singer, but when she gets caught by a perverted producer, she discovers her true talents lie elsewhere. <laughs> what do you think, bro? You gotta relax, rude dude, dude, that's his name. You're a one disgusting motherfucker, you know that? And it is that Perverted producer is supposed to be me. <laughs> uh, of course it is, dumbass. Even amateur shit's gotta sound legit these days. Hmm. My god, these people make this. But yeah, as I was saying, this chick would, could make us hella dope. I ain't gonna just hand her over to television. Makes sense. We already gave her heads up. They heard the heads up, so go ahead and film her. Who knows, maybe she'll like it. I, I need to report this to the client. Yes, report it, bro. Hello? Tell that child. I found out some things you should know. Very disturbing things. Where are you right now? Okay, I'm over at Theater Square. Good. I'll be right there, so please wait for me. Who? That's, uh... Oh my god. What's the point of hearts? I don't even know what half this shit is. Man, let me get over here. Oh my, hold on. Oh my god, grab this. Fuck. I have to be doing items, it's not that, like, you know, you need to know. Don't yell at me, boy. But if you don't, if you don't use this wall, oh my god, dude. There we go. Alright. I got I gotta I gotta wait till like I don't have to worry about fucking up my um, roommates is in and uh stomach start hurting and I can do these voices, bro. I gotta I gotta go. I'm sorry. Bye.